Whoops. Man, wrong car. Let's try this. Okay. All right, let's go. You know, you got the coupe version, of course, and then you got the convertible. The convertible spider version or Aperta is always more limited. So that's what I got. But this particular, this car took longer because it had special paint. You got the burgundy paint, the metallic historic paint. You got the ivory uh, stripe, which is also a historic color. What really took a lot of time is the burgundy carbon fiber. Whenever in Ferrari, when you order color carbon fiber, it takes longer. So although this, uh, you know, if you wanted to have everything very standard, you can get, I would have got the car first, but I didn't want that. And I, I wanted to have a special color because this is a car that I'll keep and it's very special. I love the lines. I love how, how it is. I didn't think when I got the 458 Speciale Aperta that I would like something better, but I really like this 488 Pista Spider better. If you want to drive something nice and, and, and calm, you might as well drive a Bentley or a Rolls Royce. But right now, we're trying to, we're driving a sports car. It should be aggressive, it should be fast, and it should be cutting the corners and being tight. I like the convertible because it just gives you that extra freedom, that feeling. The wind blowing through your hair, uh, the, the, the top is down so that you can hear the engine better. When the top's up and the window's up, you really can't hear it. That is so visual, that, that gives you so much sensation. And that's, and that's what I'm after when you drive these cars, what, what are you trying to achieve? You're trying to achieve that, which is why, in a way, uh, the electric cars, I mean, and I'm not against electric cars, you know, I'm a very high-tech guy as far as why I like the gadgets. But in cars, when you have an electric car, yeah, you have the performance, you have the speed going quick and, and everything like that, nothing is quicker. But you don't have the sound, you don't have the feeling. You don't have these aggressive lines that, that appeal to your eyes. You don't have uh, the all the passion, the Italian passion and the design that comes with this car. It's more than, when you buy a car, it's more than just the quickness and the speed, okay? It's also the, a lot of the other visual things, right? So that, that's how I feel about that. <laughs> it off of uh, manual you put it on a manic of course we know this is reverse this is a launch control where where if you push launch control you can engage where you have your foot in the brake you put the gas it the, the 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 engine turns when you release the gas it just punches so you're not going from us from a kind of a, a 1000 and and slowly work up the rpms when you put the pulse control you can have it maybe at 5000 rpms and so the engine's already going that fast. You let go of the clutch, it hits it at that speed. So you get a quicker, uh, you get a quicker launch from, from, from stop, right? This is the uh, windows. This is the back uh, window here. And the, uh, this is the convertible top as it goes up. This is all your cooling stuff. You know, um, this is your lift, your front lift, which is important. So this is the RM, uh, Richard Mill RM 1103, very popular. It's a, a chronograph, which means a stopwatch. And it's got the uh, skeleton and it's got a date. So um, it's got the second. So it's really a, a chronograph and it's got the NTPT, which is a carbon material, uh, very light, very strong uh, case. Well, I hope you guys enjoy the ride. And if you like this, remember to subscribe and smash the like button, okay? Now I read all the comments, so you tell me which car you want me to drive next. 
Is it the SF90? Is it the Enzo? Is it the F40? Let me know.